this one you just gotta need a set of weights and play on the floor. So go on the floor, grab your weights, one in each hand, and you're gonna go in a C sit position with your legs up or down, whatever is easier for you. So, but I would do the legs up if you can, so it's extra uh, stress on your abs. Pull the weights out and you're gonna do an ab crossovers. You're gonna take your right hand, fully extend it over to the left side, pull it back, the same to the other side. You'll feel your abdominals contracting. Try to keep your actual torso area straight and not like rotate with it. Let your arms do it. You'll feel the sides. Keeping those. Do about 10 on each side and uh, pause and do another set or two that you feel comfortable with. Then get right back into it. Next one, you're gonna take both hands in one hand. We'll hold it together like this. If it's too much weight, you can do one, but do both if you can. Go in the middle, and you're gonna tap to the ground, and then you're gonna tap the other side. So you're doing side ab rotation. And again, keep your torso straight, okay? As you pivot. it. It's really good, I don't feel it. <laughs> and again, do 10 on each side and do about like two or three sets as much as you can do. Now for the stretch portion, for abs, you can hug your knees in. Just give it a nice stretch. Or you can also, for added one, go on your back, hug your knees in, and you can rock side to side. This one actually also like, relaxes your spine muscles too. Do that. And then continue with the stretch. You wanna do a flat stretch where you just lay down completely flat. And put your hands over your head and just stretch out like this. Make sure you scoop in the belly and then as much as you can and then breathe out. So just do that a couple times, deep breaths. And yeah, so pretty much that's it for this week and we'll see you next week.